Whether you're running a business, writing a blog, or freelancing, a website is essential. But how do you get started with building one? Well, lucky for us, it's easier than ever. In fact, you can get a website up and running in a few hours, all without any code or design skills. If that sounds great, let me show you how to make a website with AI quick and easy. In this video, we'll be using WordPress and a bunch of AI tools that will do the job for you. We'll pick a theme, customize our site, and make it look professional. With our managed WordPress hosting, you'll even be able to generate a website from a description alone. Plus, we'll get access to a ton of goodies and plugins that will make management super easy down the line. So hit that subscribe button and let's get going. First, we'll get our Manage WordPress hosting. To access this landing page, click the link in the description below. We'll want to go with the business plan since it has all the AI tools we need, like our handy AI assistant and AI troubleshooter. So click Add to Cart and choose a registration period. I recommend the 48-month plan for the best price and an additional 3 months of free hosting. Now we'll need to create a new hostinger account or log in if you already have one. Then just select your preferred payment method and fill in your information. And don't forget, there's a 10% discount with the WP10 coupon code. Make sure it's applied here before completing the payment. Next, you'll be redirected to the initial onboarding. Click Start Now, choose Create a new website, and select WordPress with AI. Now just fill in new administrator password and click next. Pick the kind of website you'll want, I'll choose a blog, and then choose your method of building it. Here we can save a lot of time by choosing a pre-built template, so let's go with that. Then you can choose to activate plugins in advance or set them later. I'll follow the recommendations. On this page, you can create posts in advance by describing the main idea of your website. You'll also find this feature later in the WordPress dashboard, so let's skip it for now. Now it's time to pick a domain name. Just type in here and you'll see if it's available. Don't have an idea yet? No worries, you can use a temporary domain for now and change it later. Then wait for a few moments until the installation is done and you'll be redirected to your HPanel dashboard. Just use this button to enter WordPress admin area and we're off to the next step. Since I chose a pre-built template earlier, we already have a website, which you can see in the preview. So now we only need to personalize it by changing things up. Here's where our AI assistant comes in. Just open up the chat window and tell it what you want to do. As an example, I'll ask about the best design choices for my personal project. Then it will come up with ideas that I can use for the site. Once you got something in mind, head to Pages menu to start designing. Here, hover over the pre-built homepage and click Edit. Now you can change the text, images, and overall layout of the page. And remember, if you ever feel stuck, the assistant is here to help. To change the style settings, you can use this panel on the right to edit the general layout configurations, background images, and display animations. The left panel, on the other hand, will let you add other elements to the site. Now, if you want to customize the overall site design, go to the Appearance menu from your WordPress dashboard and choose Customize. Here, you get to choose which part of the site to configure. For example, go to this global menu to change the site's color, fonts, and buttons. Since we're using the Astra theme, we can easily edit the header and footer too. For instance, we can go to the Header Builder menu and click this plus button to add more elements to the header. As you can see, we got a site logo in the header. Don't have one of your own yet? No worries. Let's go to our AI logo maker through the link in the description and click Create a logo. You can use AI here or just make a logo all on your own. I'll go with AI, describe my site, and choose the style from the drop-down menu. Now we simply hit Create and get a bunch of logo options. Download any that you like and go back to the WordPress dashboard. Here click on the logo element, choose Change logo and upload the logo image to the media library. And that's it, now you can go on to customize and play around with the elements. When you feel you have a hang of it, let's make some content. you'll get to create posts and pages with our AI content creator. You can find this handy tool under the Hostinger menu on your WordPress dashboard. This plugin works on any WordPress theme and helps you write search engine optimized content. Plus, it even works in other languages too. 
Here's how it works. Set the type, tone and length. Then describe the topic, add targeted keywords and hit generate content. You'll even get an automatic meta description and image to go with the text. To edit the main text, enter the post editor interface by clicking edit as a draft. Then you can assign one or more categories and tags on the right settings panel. Use categories to cover general topics and tags for things specific to the post. You can also set the visibility and publish settings to limit access to the post, keep it private or schedule when it should go live. Finally, before you're done, scroll down to the bottom of the editor. Since I chose the plugin recommendations during the site onboarding process, the all-in-one SEO plugin is automatically installed so I can see these SEO settings. Here we want to fill in the meta title and meta description for your post or page to be SEO friendly. Once that's done, just hit publish and your content will go live. With WordPress, your site is published the moment you create it. So if you skipped the main name creation during onboarding, you can get a custom one from each panel. And in case you want to promote the site while you're still building it, you can create a coming soon page too. Once you think you're done, make sure to double check your website. Hover over this part of your WordPress dashboard and click visit site. Ensure that all links, images, forms, and features work properly. Now that your site is live, it's going to need maintenance too. That means keeping your themes and plugins updated so you can keep your admin area secure. The good news is we can just do that automatically by activating the smart auto update from each panel. So navigate to the WordPress menu and open the security tab. Then turn on the toggle button to activate the auto update feature. And if you ever run into trouble, just shoot it down with our AI troubleshooter for a fast and easy solution. All right, that's everything I have for you today. If you want to add e-commerce functionality with WooCommerce, check out the video I included in the description below. All the AI tools I showed off here should help you out. Give us a like and don't forget to subscribe to Hostinger Academy. We have tons of videos about WordPress on the way, so make sure you're notified. As always, thank you for watching and good luck on your online journey.